And we have a look now at some great back to school hacks as the kids get ready to head back into the classroom. Yeah, we're trying to both speed your mornings up and also help parents think outside of the box when it comes to the kids lunch boxes. Matthew Smith joins us live Now, Matt. We've been hearing from our viewers a lot about this <laughs> this week. Yeah, we've actually been talking to them throughout the week about back to school hacks. Now, one that I'm doing right here, this is kind of cool. Uh, this one isn't going to be speed. It's just one that's a little bit more interesting. The idea here, you actually cut the uh, apple on each side of the core and what you get is this cut. Now you're wondering why do I have this wrapped around? This is actually can be used wristband, you can use a rubber band, but the idea is your apple doesn't oxidize. About an hour and a half ago we cut this thing and it looks like we just cut it moments ago. We're going to walk around the back because I've got my backpack, my uh, morning stuff that I have back here. Uh, think about when you're packing your kids lunch. One of the things that I did all the time when I was a kid, I lost my parents' uh, uh, ice packs. If you bring in the cold stuff, here's an idea that can actually save you time and money. Uh, also, it's a little bit cheaper as well. Get the opportunity, freeze apple juice boxes. I froze these last night. They're starting to thaw out right now. And in fact, uh, I'm gonna try to drink from this in just a little bit because it, the nice thing is, is now it's keeping your stuff cold, but it's also, uh, if you lose it, well, it's just one apple pack, right? Uh, here's something else. If you want to have some time savers, this week I met up with the Roble family and we talked a lot about meal preps, even dress preps. And they got two kids in the house, you see? So they're all about meal prepping. But today we came up with some new ideas that they hadn't even thought of. And yes, that is why if you're taking a look at your screen here, you're gonna see us making peanut butter and jelly sandwiches there. How big of a help can some of the time saving hacks that we're gonna be previewing in the next half hour be? Well, listen to Nicole explain how big of a change she noticed when her family started started a meal prep. I have everything planned out in advance and I look and I say, girls, we have an extra 10 minutes. Mm. This is this is fantastic. So we can go ahead and, you know, do whatever it is that they need to do or do you have a couple minutes? Do you want me to go over your spelling words one more time because you have a spelling test coming up this week? So we have a little extra time to go ahead and get some more things done that we might not otherwise. So how many peanut butter and jellies could you possibly make? We made a ton and we froze them. You might think that sounds a little gross. We'll explain why that works out and how delicious it can actually be and how much time you can save over the course of a month by doing that. That story's coming up in the next half hour. Wait, wait. We're live this morning, Matthew Smith, 7 Action News. Did he say freeze the sandwich? Yeah. But I think lunch is on Matt. He's got a bunch of sandwiches, <laughs> he's got some hungry. apples. Let's do this. I'm gonna eat them all. Oh, okay. oh, we'll see about that. <laughs> Thanks, Matt. We'll check